Cassandra, for purposes of the book, is someone who anticipated the likely course of events in a reasoned way and uh, was ignored. Why are Cassandras important? Well, frequently after a strate strategic surprise, the main explanation that allows everyone to sleep at night is, well, a failure of imagination occurred. And after all, no one can get blamed for a failure of imagination. But the fact is, a Cassandra is someone who imagined the likely course of events, but whom the CIA either sidelined or ignored. And after each surprise that we talk about in the book, the Cuban Missile Crisis, the fall of the Shah of Iran, the collapse of the Soviet Union, and 9-11, we identify people, both inside and outside the CIA, who anticipated the likely course of events in a reasoned way, and for reasons of group identity and the CIA's culture, were sidelined or ignored. So, in effect, Cassandras falsify the idea that strategic surprises are somehow inevitable, and they falsify the idea that we can be satisfied with the explanation of a failure of imagination when it comes to strategic surprises.